Hello, good evening. How are you? Hello, Maria, Maria Stephanie, Maria Eva, Maria Eve, Quentin. Hi, good evening. Hello, hello. Hello, Hi. Here is a little bit cold. Elida, how are you? How are you, Elida? Mm -hmm. I can listen, Elida. Okay. Okay, my friends, so we're going to check here. Elida, what is your complete name, Elida? Elida, regaleme su nombre completo para escribírselo por acá. Elida. Elida, su nombre completo, please. No. Yo creo que no escucha quizá. Escucha, no me escucha quizá. Esto se le ha friseado. Ok. So, now let me see. Okay, so my friends, we are six in this moment. Yanira, Wendy, Stephanie. Wendy is eating cereal. El cereal del niño se está comiendo. <laughs> es que acabo de venir de trabajar. Chocobito. Ay, te tocó difícil este día, Wendy, por la temporada. Ya me imagino. Sí, desde el jueves vamos ya bien con todo. Sí, ay, me imagino. Está tremendo eso. Pero es temporal. Sí. Vale la pena. Okay, <laughs> okay Miss. So we're going to start here with uh this is the first part. I'm gonna start here with um this is a video, a video with the present continuous. Just give me a moment. I am preparing this for you. Just give me a second, a second, a second, a second, a second. No, it's not this one. Just give me a second. Okay, so in the first, in this video, we're going to see the difference between simple present versus present continuous. So we're going to check that through this video. So please listen and pay attention. Let me see. <clears throat> this one. Creo que no se lo With audio, compartir con audio. This one. I am speaking English. Can you listen, class? Can you listen the video? Yes. Okay. Yes. yes. Okay, let's yes. go. Present simple versus present continuous tense. English grammar lesson. I speak English. English. I am speaking English. What is the difference? I speak English is in the present simple tense. 
I am speaking English is in the present continuous tense. When do we use the present simple and when do we use the present continuous? Let's look at each one. The present simple tense. We use the present simple tense for facts or things that are always true or generally true. Whales live in the ocean. This is a fact. This is always true. A dog has four legs. This is generally true. Unfortunately, some dogs have three legs or less. But in general, it is true. It rains a lot in winter. Yes, this is generally true. Water boils at 100 degrees Celsius. This is a fact, just like the fact that water freezes at zero degrees Celsius. The present simple tense is also used for regular habits or repeated actions. These are often daily routines and they happen always, often, generally, every week, etc. I brush my teeth three times a day. I read in bed every night. She goes to the gym after work. He walks to school every day. Common time expressions used with the present simple tense are always, often, generally, normally, sometimes, never, every day, every week, every year. Note that the time word is in the singular form. Day, not days. Once a day, twice a week, three times a month. Then the rest are four times, five times, etc. In the morning, in the afternoon, at night. We don't say in the night. I recommend seeing our video about prepositions of time at, on and in. On Mondays, on Fridays. When the day is in plural, it refers to all Mondays, all Fridays. Present continuous tense. We use the present continuous tense for an action happening right now at the moment of speaking. When somebody is doing something right now or something is happening right now. I am teaching an English lesson. Yes, that is what's happening right now. You are watching a video. Yes. That is what you are doing right now. Steve is washing his hair. She is taking her dog for a walk. You can see that these actions are happening right now and they are temporary actions, normally for a short period of time. The present continuous is also used to talk about something that is happening around the time of speaking, but not necessarily at that exact moment. This action is in progress and hasn't finished. I am reading a great book. It doesn't necessarily mean that I'm reading a book right at this moment. It refers to this moment of my life. I've started reading this book and I haven't finished it yet. They are staying at a local hotel because the roof of their house was damaged during the storm. It doesn't necessarily mean that they are at the hotel right at this moment. Maybe they are at work right now or somewhere else. This situation is temporary. Jack is learning Italian. It doesn't necessarily mean he is learning the language right now at a desk with all of his language books. It refers to this moment of his life. 
common time expressions used with the present continuous are now, right now, at the moment, still. Now let's compare the two tenses together. Here are the sentences from the beginning of this lesson. I speak English. I am speaking English. We say I speak English because it is a fact. I generally speak English, so we use the present simple tense. We say I am speaking English because it refers to what I am doing now. It is a temporary action because in a moment I might start speaking in Spanish. So we use the present continuous. Let's compare more sentences. I live in England. We use the present simple for things that don't change for a long time. I plan to live in England for a long time and I don't plan to change soon. It is more or less permanent. But if I say I am living in London at the moment, I use the present continuous because this situation is temporary. Next month, I plan to live in a different city. Another example. It rains a lot in winter. We use the present simple because this is a fact or is generally true. It is raining right now. We use the present continuous because we are talking about an action that is happening right now. It is in progress. It will not continue forever. It is temporary. Tomorrow, it might be sunny. Look at this cartoon. What is he doing? He is biting his nails because he is nervous. This sentence shows the action is happening now. He is biting his nails right now. Does he always do this when he is nervous? Yes. He always bites his nails when he's nervous. The second sentence uses the present simple because it is talking about his habit. Something that he does when he is nervous. Notice how we use the present simple tense with the adverb of frequency always. Let's compare the present simple and present continuous in affirmative sentences, negative sentences, and in questions. Here are two affirmative sentences. I eat cereal every day. This is my habit, my routine. I'm eating cereal right now. This is an action happening now. Let's look at the negative form. I do not eat cereal every day. No, sometimes I have pancakes for breakfast. Yum. I am not eating cereal right now. No, I am eating broccoli. We use do not or does not to make negative sentences in the present simple. Remember, we can use the contractions don't and doesn't. We add not between to be and the verb to make negative sentences in the present continuous. And making questions. Do you eat cereal every day? Is this your habit or routine? Are you <coughs> eating cereal right now? Is this what you're doing right now? We use do or does to make questions in the present simple tense. We change the order of the subject or subject pronoun and the conjugation of the verb to be when making questions in the present continuous tense. 
Questions. Same verbs, different meanings. Questions can have the same verb, but its meaning changes depending on if the question is in the present simple or present continuous. For example, what do you do? This means, what is your job? But when I say, what are you doing? This means, what action or what thing are you doing right now? Another example, what do you read? This means, what type of books do you like to read? What are you reading? This means, what is the name of the book you're reading right now? I hope you found this grammar lesson about the present simple versus present continuous useful. If you did, click the like button and remember to subscribe to our channel so you know when... The review about a simple present versus present continuous, okay? So based on this, we're going to we're going to practice the following exercise. Just give me a present. This one. <laughs> I'm going to share with you here the link. No, this is not a link. The file. It is here that says unit six. This one. Okay, can you see the file here in the chat? Okay, we are going to work on this file and we are going to watch some videos in order to um to answer the, the video guide. And the video guide is let me see this one. Is this the name is I'm getting in shape unit six. That's just give me a moment. Just give me a moment. <clears throat> is this one you need you need this one? Okay, I already shared with you uh, the handout that we are going to use to complete this exercise. So in the handout, you have the, uh, here the topic is I'm getting in shape and we have the scene one, for example, it says complete the sentences and circle the correct answer. So you have this section that you have to complete based on the video guide on the video episode. And this is the video guide for you to complete. You have uh, three pages in here. You are going to answer the questions according to the scene number two. So this is the scene number one. This is the scene number two. And then number three, it's the you do like to exercise, okay? So I'm going to share with you here the <clears throat> this is the link for the video episode <laughs> so this is the first one
What are you doing? I'm exercising. Don't you have some work to do? Can you listen? Yes, yes. Okay, okay. I am working. I'm working and exercising. What are you doing? I'm exercising. Don't you have some work to do? I am working. I'm working and exercising. What work are you doing? I'm thinking. About what? About ideas for Mrs. Beatty's vacation. And what are you thinking? Beach vacation. <laughs> Can you go exercise somewhere else? No problem. <laughs> Una gripe, no la dejé ella. Pero se me dio mucho moco. What are you doing? Mucho moco. Getting in shape. Why are you doing that here? Why don't you go to a gym? Or the park? Or outside? Or home? I don't have time to go to the gym. I can't work when you do that. Can you go over there? No problem. Bob, <laughs> what are you doing? I'm working. Then why are you running? To get in shape. Running burns a lot of calories. Exercise later. Work now, please. Yes, sir. So that is the first video episode, and in here, in here, this one is the video for the first, for the page number one, the video episode, the scene number one. And in the next video, you're going to have the scene number two. This is the scene two for the page number two. So you are going to answer according to the, I generally go running in the video. morning. Okay, so I'm going to share the, uh, the link with it for this. And here, this is the link for the page one, page two. And then to continue with the interview that says do you like to exercise? This is uh this is the page number I three. Fan. Yes, I love to run. Do you like I run to in the exercise? morning before work and I run on Saturdays and Sundays? How do you protect group? And I go uh this is for the page so. number three. That is this one. The page number three that we have here. This one. Okay. So the scene one and the scene number two is in the link number one. And the interview is in the link number two. Interview. Do you like to exercise? That is on the link number two. So I'm going to share here with you. Link number one, and this is the link number two for the interview. Okay. So I'm going to organize the groups so that we're going to start working on the exercise. Let me see if I have group four. Yes, in group four, I have room number one, Elida, Evelyn, and Jose. Room number two, Adilio, Alfredo, and Maria. Number three, Maria Eva, Melvin, Alessandro. Well, in the number four, Stephanie and Janet. Okay? I'm going to open the rooms and you please start working with your group. Open the video and take notes in your video guide.
No podemos compartir pantalla. Nadie en el grupo puede compartir. Yo no puedo. La calle es que mi amor. Yes, Teacher, uh -huh. este, en mi caso, como me conecté algo tarde, no logré descargar el PDF que mandó. Ah, ok, ok, en este momento. Ok, there you are. Y creo que son dos, dos videos, ¿verdad? links, yes. Nadie los tiene tenemos, en el grupo. Solo tenemos uno. Okay. Son dos. Uno, el primero te lleva al, al, a la actividad uno y dos. Ajá. Y el tercero ya es la interview. Okay. Okay. Ahora sí, Melvin. Sí, ahora sí. Gracias, teacher. Thank you. Gracias. Okay. Ya regresé, ya viene mi esposo, va a ayudar. Ah. <risa> ya nos pasaron este, los enlaces, este, Wendy. Okay. Ah, okay. No problem. Lo vamos a descargar. Sí, sí. Creo que nos puede compartir el el el, el PDF. Sí. De nuevo. Mm -hmm. Okay. Es que se nos perdió. Mm -hmm. Okay. Here you are. ¿Ya lo tienen? ¿Tienen los links? Yes. Ok, ok, continúen. Tienes el link, puedes compartir pantalla. Luego, luego se salió del, del grupo. No sé. Es que no, nadie puede compartir pantalla, yo tampoco. No lo puede mandar individual. No, lo voy a unir a otro grupo, José. 
Okay. Sería aquí la B. Luego dice Mary has both to go to. En la dos sería Mary has both to go to. En la sería la eh, la A ¿O cuál sería? <ríe> Ay, no. Eso es después que le, que le habla, ponga otra vez el video. Lo ponemos de rollo. Es. Vale. Yo lo pongo aquí, quiero ver ¿no? qué parte es. Ah, ok. Vale, La C creo que es verdad. La B creo que... ¿Cuál? Es que le mencionó el Jim. Jim. No, entonces tengo, no sé si sería la A o la C. Pero es que ella le pregunta, ella, él, ella le pregunta a él. Ella le pregunta, ella le dice esa respuesta. Uh -huh. O a Paul. Vea el video. Veamos el video entonces. Ok. Sí, ya lo vi. Muy bien. Le dice ella, yo creo que esta es la respuesta. Adelántelo al minuto 1.30. Al 1.30. Ahí lo va a encontrar. Uh -huh. Un poquito. Uh -huh. Bueno, Ah, no, es que ese es... Uh... Did you finish here? No, aún no. <laughs> okay, okay. Ahí donde está el icono de... ¿Cómo se llama? ¿De Chrome? No le aparece qué? la pantalla. Abajo. Ahí, ahí. Allí, sí. Allí, allí regresa a la pantalla. Con nosotros. En la Z de Zoom. Abajo. El iconito azul. Uh -huh. Ajá. Ahí le doy. Ahí sí, selecciona. Sí. Pues sí, sí, como si yo, la, yo les veo, pero no sé, yo en la agenda no sé dónde está. No le sale, mire, Wendy. 
No, <ríe> ¿dónde está el alarme? Usted no lo tiene. Y allí en Chrome, más a su derecha. Ahí. Es donde está, es donde está ahorita. Es donde estoy ahora, sí. Y si minimiza todo. Vamos a ver. Minimiza todo otra vez. ¿Ese también? Ese no se puede. No. Ese también se tendría que salir. Que se está actualizando las cosas. Ah, quizás por eso. Uh -huh. No se puede salir. Ajá. Ah, pues quizás por eso es. Entonces, ¿qué hago? Y no podemos compartir nosotros hasta que usted deje de compartir. <risa> ah, entonces yo dejo de compartir entonces, ¿no? Sí, eso sí lo sé hacer. Ahí ah. estuvo. <risa> pues eso pensamos sí. que no podía. <risa> no, eso sí, pero lo que yo no, no sabía es cómo volver al otro enlace, pero dejar de compartir. <risa> <risa> Ay, no le digo, pues. Ahora entonces, el siguiente enlace. Sí, el siguiente video. La teacher no va a regañar porque ahí está. Lo siento, Miss. Lo sentimos. Are you an exercise fan? Yes, I love to run. If I run in the morning before work, can I run on Saturdays and Sundays along the river? And the Are you a fan of exercise? Not really. So, Peter, would you consider yourself a couch potato? No, I'm not a couch potato. Absolutely not. I, I just, I hate to exercise. So do you actually have a routine that you follow every day? Yeah. You go out to, I go to the park. And, uh, meet the people who are in my age group. They're 80, 60, 70. We have quite a number of 80s and 190 year olds. And we either walk or we run for about three and a half miles. And I go, uh, I go to the park when I'm not, no, three days a week I go to the pool and walk in the water. And uh, the rest of the time I go to the park and walk. How often do you do Tai Chi? Uh, about once a week. So uh, do you feel exercise is important? Yes, I think it's important. <laughs> but not enough to do it more than once a week. <laughs> well, to be honest, I'm... No, manda hacer ejercicio a, a otro lado. Esa. you don't you have some work to do i am work i am working working de trabajar working mm -hmm. así ajá uh -huh. Okay. 
I'm working. I'm thinking, thinking about thinking. T H E King. Así se como se escucha. T H I N K I N G. Okay, ajá, sí. Thinking. And, and.
Yo creo que aquí, aquí lo hemos colocado mal. Aquí creo que lo hemos colocado mal porque eh, si no, esta queda, nos queda afuera. So, yeah, what are you doing? What are you doing? Pero por otro dice que se va a comer todo bien. Sí. Yo lo que le da. No, esta es la última yes sir es la última primero sería I am working entonces I am working luego sería what are do you do sería la dos la dos luego si sí sería la tres esta como aquí eh, eh, no es primero Mr. Evans que habla. Que le pregunta, what are you doing? Sí, el, 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 el post. Bob uh -huh. es el, el gordito. Ajá, sí. Entonces él le pregunta, ¿qué es lo que estás? What, what are you doing? Entonces are... Bob responde le dice, I am working then. le responde sería entonces, esta sería la dos uh -huh. Bob are Bob. I am working I am working uh -huh. uh -huh. Uh -huh. where are you running le dice el jefe tengo uh -huh. que borrar esta tu running esa la la tres sería esa esta Evans Mr. Evans donde dice Mr. Evans en la tres ajá aquí la tres verdad aquí dónde está ajá right. okay no, 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 sería la tres donde dice este, we are you running, ahí, la tres. Aquí, aquí. Sí, porque después Bob le responde to get in shape, Ronnie, uh -huh. y sería la cuatro. Un, dos, tres. Aquí sería uh, tres. Esta sería la cuatro entonces. Esa, sí, esa la cuatro. Esa. Sí, esa. Y esa sería la cinco. Y aquí la, la última. Ah, última. No me podía <ríe> Bueno. Ay, quién sabe qué es, sí, pero bueno. <ríe> vale, esto ya es para el siguiente video, ¿verdad? Pero. Pues, lo, lo, colo, lo pongo. Es lo mismo, creo yo. Pero sí, es el segundo mismo. video. No, no es el segundo video. No, no lo hemos visto. Es, este, este es el segundo. Se mira la imagen ahí del video. Sí, se ve. ¿Se escucha? Sí, se escucha. Okay. Are you an exercise fan? Yes, I love to run. I run in the morning before work, and I run on Saturdays and Sundays along the river and through the park. Are you a fan of exercise? Not really. So, Rita, would you consider yourself a couch potato? No, I'm not a couch no. potato. Absolutely not. I, I just, I hate to exercise. So do you actually have a routine that you follow? Every day, yes. We go out, uh, I go to the park and uh, meet uh, people who are in my age group. They're 80, 60, 70. We have quite a number of 80s and 190 year old. <laughs> and we either walk or we run for about three and a half miles. And I go, uh, I go to the park when I'm not, no, three days a week I go to the pool 
and walk in the water. And uh, the rest of the time I go to the park and walk. Okay, hello everybody. Ahora tuvieron mucho mucho dificultad para compartir pantalla, right? Yes, yes, sí, yes, se yes. nos complicó bastante. Mm. Okay, okay, okay. So you couldn't finish the exercise. No, no. you didn't finish. Okay. Oh, so, uh, uh, well, I'm gonna we're gonna continue with this page tomorrow because uh, today we couldn't finish. Nada más que vea que mañana puede estar en un dispositivo del cual usted pueda manipular el, el PDF, porque si no desde el celular se puede, pero es un poquito más difícil. Y a veces no se puede como editar tan tan rápido, ¿verdad? Así que para que el día de mañana verifique tener un dispositivo que, 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 que tenga más eh, disponibilidad la herramienta para que usted pueda, pueda digitar. ¿Sí? If not, con uno que pueda en el grupo, estaríamos bien, ¿verdad? No tiene que hacerlo, no tienen que hacerlo todo, solo con uno que esté, no hay problema. Ok. So, and just let me check here your, your names, your attendance. Okay. Solo Elida se me quedó con un nombre y un apellido, Elida. What's your complete name? No se le escucha. Elida del Carmen. Ah, okay, okay. Enrique okay. de Riva. Okay, so we're going to stop it here and we're going to continue tomorrow, okay? Have a good night. Good night, everybody. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow.